Hey friends, Katrina Sawa here. I wanted to go live. I haven't been online for a couple of days, it looks like. Uh, well, I've been there, but I've been kind of hiding in behind the scenes, I guess. Um, been really focused, heads down, on finishing my next Jumpstart Your Blank book, which is the compilation book uh, that I've been doing. Uh, so I'm really excited that we've got 12 authors this year in volume number two. This is volume number one. So we're going to be doing a book launch in December. So I just wanted to give you a heads up that I need all the support that I can get um, to help these authors be international bestsellers in December. And fun thing, hi Lori, hey Brian. Um, fun thing is I just became another, uh, I just got my ninth book. So the uh, itty bitty, uh, your amazing itty bitty book of words just came out. I'm on page 288. My, my word of course is jumpstart, duh. And uh, <clears throat> this is, uh, a compilation of like I don't even know 270 authors or something like that crazy we just became international bestsellers um, a week or so ago so that was fun with my friend Susie Pruden she runs the itty bitty uh, publishing company so if you're looking to write a book I was just talking to somebody that I met in Seattle uh, last month <clears throat> who said oh I've always wanted to write a book but I'm not good enough and I'm like stop it because you always have something to you have a, your own story. Everybody has their story, um, and it should be heard. It should be heard. If you can just help one person with your life lessons or your story, it's an amazing feeling to know that you've helped that one person. But knowing the world, you're going to help a lot more than just one person. Hey, Lorraine. Hi, Colleen. I'll be talking to you soon. And uh, so, yes, so the books is really fun that's been going on in the last few weeks. Um, I've been traveling quite a bit, and I'm so excited that I'm done traveling for the year. Yay! I'm so excited. Um, I know for some of you, it seems like, oh my God, you're too busy, but I'm not too busy. I am perfectly busy, frankly. Um, and I'm not really, I don't feel like I'm busy. I just have a lot going on, which I love. I thrive on it, you guys. Uh, just like some people, unfortunately, thrive on drama. I thrive on like really cool business projects that I'm working on. So I love helping and inspiring other entrepreneurs to make a lot more money. So my live event that was in LA about a week and a half ago was amazing. We had 50 people show up and there was uh, so many ahas and people were making money. I don't know if you know this, but I teach people how to do easy yes offers. Easy yes offers, not easy ass offers. Easy yes offers. That means you can make money anywhere you go. Like you can have a $20 thing or a $50 thing or a $100 offer and literally make money everywhere you go if you're confident, if you get in front of more people, and if you're prepared to take the credit card or make the money or ask for the sale, frankly. So some people made thousands of dollars. Some people made hundreds of dollars at my event. It was super fun to watch. I have these fun little um, name badge ribbons that I give to people when they make money uh, every time they make a sale, whether it's a $10 sale or a $1,000 sale, they get a ribbon. And Gail Barbie was one was my winner of the most sales. I think she made 31 sales. So she sold 31, maybe even more people in the room. So she made 310 bucks because it was a $10 deal. And she had all of these ribbons. It was so cute. And then I think Susie Pruden was the one that sold the most <clears throat> money because she did get a couple new authors for Itty Bitty Books. So she actually had people that said they were gonna write a book. So she made the most money at the event. Um, and then of course, people signed up for my Live Big Mastermind, which is what I like to offer at these live events. And uh, the Live Big Mastermind is open now for enrollment. If you guys have been thinking about uh, joining a mastermind or you want that community or you want that accountability or you want the mentoring, um, I'm a real reality check kind of gal. In fact, I'm redesigning my website right now and I thought about it in the shower this morning. I think, I really think I'm gonna put something on my website, like you want the reality check of what to do and not to do in your business when you're just starting out, or even if you've been in business for a while and you just wanna know the nuts and bolts of what you need to do, or what not to do, or where to invest your money, where not to invest your money, that's me. I love to save people 
thousands of dollars and months and months of time by getting them on the right track uh, in order of importance. It's very important that we, we learn things, we implement things, and we uh, um, implement our ideas in order of importance for you and your goals. Everybody has different goals. Everybody has different priorities in their life. And it's so important to <clears throat> make sure especially if you're limited with the income or the income at the moment or you're limited with cash flow and you have a, you have to spend it wisely right in the right places you've got to make sure you know your order of importance super important so i would love to have a conversation with you if you're interested about that no pressure seriously i do not want to work with you if it is not a good fit <laughs> so i am a no pressure gal i I know there's plenty of people out there that are the perfect fit for me, and then there's plenty of people who are not. And you just have to have that kind of a mentality when you're going into, um, you know, any kind of a conversation with somebody who might be interested, really. And uh, so if you're remotely interested, it's about my mastermind or coaching or writing a book yourself or whatever, please just uh, send me a private message and we'll set up a call. Um, I have plenty of time to talk with you. Uh, believe it or not, no matter how busy I look, I look busy on purpose. That's positioning. <laughs> so sometimes it's positioning to look busy. Like I don't want to, I'm not too busy to talk to an entrepreneur who needs help. I'm not too busy to talk to my own clients. Um, in fact, they're my highest priority and they have my cell phone and they can dial me anytime they want to, right? So, um, so I'm just putting that out there because I don't want there to be this thing that you might think, oh, she's too busy to talk to me, whatever. No, I, it breaks my heart to see people, entrepreneurs who are not making the kind of money that you deserve and not living the kind of life that you want. And I want to help you get there faster. So I'm all about that. Uh, faster path to cash. <clears throat> um, implementation, getting to know the how. Um, so anyways, come and talk to me. A couple other things that are super fun. Uh, obviously it's fall, right? We're getting into Thanksgiving next week. Uh, I have my mastermind weekend this weekend. So that's super fun. I get, people are coming to my house. Uh, we have a small intimate group coming and we're going to powwow. But then uh, my mom is coming to visit, which is super fun. I just saw her in Vegas because I went from my live event for four days in, in LA. Then I stayed in LA for a couple days because I'm a part of a mastermind actually with Craig Deswalt and uh, my whole rock star family, Rock Your Life Mastermind. And uh, so I was there for two days. And then I flew out to Vegas to speak at the Polka Dot Powerhouse in Vegas, which was fun. They have a great chapter. Uh, and saw my mom, because she lives out there, and so that was fun. I helped her organize, oh my God. I don't know if you know this about me, but one of the fun things about me is I'm a super organized. Like, I'm the only thing that is sometimes a mess is sometimes my desk, because I have too many people to follow up with. <laughs> And they're just stacks of people to follow up with right now, which is great. It's a great problem to have, right? So uh, that's what I'm doing the rest of the day when I'm not on a call. Or the rest of the week, I should say, is doing follow-up. So are you doing your follow-up, right? Hmm. Maybe that will get you more clients and make you more money if you just pick up the phone. One thing I have, I have a new client who helps people with their sales conversations. That's something I do too, but she is building a business around helping people with their conversations that they need to have in order to sell stuff. So you've got to be really good with that sales conversation. I don't care if you're selling um, lotions and potions in a network marketing business or a $40,000 thing or anything in between. If you're not good at the sales part of it, the sales conversation, you're going to have a long, tough road. So we do have to work on our sales conversation. Anywho, so yeah, my last, it's what's really funny is like uh, when I looked at how many flights I took on Southwest, usually I take Southwest because usually it goes almost everywhere. It's just sometimes when I go to the East Coast, I have to fly another airline. But I love Southwest. I don't know if you guys do, but it's just so easy, free, free luggage check, all that kind of stuff. Um, and... So I had my 25th flight. And you know what it means when you have 25 flights in one year? It means you're an A-lister. 
So I don't know if you guys know this. So I've been an A-lister for like three years. And uh, it one year, like in January, it turned off. Like I must not have made enough flights. It was like, a, I think it would be this year. And I was like, oh, man, when I checked in, because usually when you're an A-lister and you check in, you get priority boarding status no matter when you check in. So that's kind of fun. Um, but the so as I'm proud to be an A-lister for next year, I know I, I'm also going, oh, man, 25 flights. That was too many probably for last year. I'm not going to be flying that much this coming year. Um, I'm doing a lot more uh, Zoom calls and, and Zoom networking. Are you guys doing that? Because Zoom is like the new networking. It's definitely the new networking. I'm a huge networker. I'm, of course, very outgoing, and I know not everybody is. But when I first started my business 17 years ago, all I did was network, network, network in person in my local area. That's it. I went to 14 to 15 networking events every single month. Yes, I said 14 or 15 every month. Most of you are not doing that and you're wondering why I'm not getting enough clients. We'll go networking, right? Um, and so I did that for three years and I built a pretty successful business because I was really good at follow-up. So I went networking and I did my follow-up. I did networking, I did my follow-up and I was good in sales. Um, and then three years into my business is when I learned about all this online marketing and online coaching stuff. And so it was really fun to be able to up-level myself at that point. And I've obviously been up-leveling it ever since. You want to always keep evolving and up-leveling your business. Um, but now with the Zoom calls, a lot of people are doing networking online. So you'll see like rooms of, on Zoom, about 30 or 40 people. I belong to a few different organizations who do monthly or bi-monthly calls where you can just log into a Zoom and meet 30 or 40 people. You can do self-introductions. You can chat in the chat room. You can take it off to a phone call. You can put links in there to say, oh, go get my free audio on how to jumpstart yourself as a speaker or whatever it is, right, that, that somebody's asking for in their commercial. And you're like, oh, here, I have this resource for you. So people get signed up on my email newsletter from those things. We set up uh, follow-up calls from that kind of a call. It's really amazing. And so now I probably do about 10 Zoom calls a month. And I don't even have to leave. And I get to promote all my stuff because, look, I got books behind me, right? So I've got a whole host of books. So <clears throat> when you are doing an online call like that, make sure you're in a place that really positions you, position, you know, whether in your house. Please, I would highly recommend you don't necessarily sit on your bed with the pillows behind you if you're trying to position yourself as someone who is a higher end coach or something like that, right? Get a really good place where you can put your laptop, not a phone that goes like this and you're wiggling all around, right? Uh, where you can actually position yourself and have a good backdrop, a good background. Now, I wish you could see my whole painting up there. I actually had this uh, custom designed isn't it cool? I love this painting. It's Live Big. And on the side, it says, uh, Believe, Invest, and Give. That's what big stands for. So I made that up. And then I had someone uh, I had someone custom paint that and, and create that for me. So that's now my logo for my Live Big Mastermind and my Live Big events and all that, um, which is super fun. Um, but put a little, put a little, positioning in behind you. Put your floor banner up perhaps or uh, some other kind of signage or even if it's just a cool saying like a quote or something that you like, blow it up real big so we can see it from video and uh, that's just a quick tip. <clears throat> oh, thanks for the kudos. Hey Cherie and Jeanette and Sarah and Lorraine and Laura. Thanks for being here you guys. Please comment. Let me know what you're up to in November or December for the rest of the year. I know some of you have, this is your busiest time of year because you're selling stuff for the holidays, right? So you're a holiday product or service. Um, usually people don't want to talk to me the last couple of weeks of the year. Um, they're focused on other things and family, which is totally fine. But I am, um, I am going to be doing a planning webinar. So like a 2020 planning webinar. I usually do this every year. And because I have a really cool process for planning in your business and, and getting stuff um, really organized. Like I said, I'm super organized, you guys, with my computer, 
with my files, with uh, my projects, with my calendar, with my time. And it pays off because I can really get a lot done. And uh, it, it doesn't wear me down or, or, you know, I don't have to work a gazillion hours to, to get it all done. So I'm super organized. I have a team of amazing team who helps me. And uh, whether you can afford a lot of people to help you right now or not, or maybe just a couple hours a month, something to think about. So anywho, I just wanted to come on and say hi and uh, give you a little what's been going on in my world. And I'd love to hear from you too. So comment below and or send me a private message and uh, let's connect. Okay. Have a great week, you guys. Happy uh, Thanksgiving. Hopefully I'll come back next week and say hello as well. All right. Bye.